you got a boogie, wipe it on your shirt. Good job. So a little bit of update on the plumbing here. Oh, this morning, James was over here working by himself. Man, it's bright outside. Um, because Levi was sleeping over in the camper, so I couldn't be over here to help. But now I'm over here, and I'm just kind of checking in on what he's doing. So first is that he dug a giant hole for that black thing to go in and put that in there. And so then we measured out where the pipe tracks are going to be for the toilet and the shower and the downstairs bathroom. So we measured that out. And now we dug the trench for that, and now we're putting in the actual piping and everything. So... That's kind of where we are currently with the process. And let me tell you, it is a process. Poor James, he kept trying to bury this giant black thing in the ground that you see there in the corner. And because it's rained so much recently, there's a lot of water underneath this pea gravel that they put down. So every time he would dig the hole and stick in that giant black container, it would start to float back up to the top. So the poor guy dug that hole in this nasty, wet, clay, pea gravel crap, dug it three times, and put it in there three times, and all three times it ended up coming back up, even after he buried it under all the pea gravel, it pushed it up. So we ended up filling it up with water, and then burying it, and that was able to keep it down. So anyway, it was a very frustrating process, but now that's finally done. The rest of this is just kind of tedious, so we're getting it finished. And James is making the measurements now for all of our pipes, and making the cuts, and we're gonna piece it together. We are slowly getting it done, just a little bit at a time. Hi, babe. Hi. Hi, Eli. What are you doing? I'm catching a fish. You're catching a fish. With the hoe? Good idea. Stop. I'm a cute hoe. I got it. Good job. on your legs. Hi. Update on the house here. You want to stay over here while I go grab a seat? Yeah. I'll have to take my chainsaw and stuff. Okay. Don't drop it. I won't. So James is going to cut down a cedar tree to put in over here. If you can see that, I have no idea if my hand's even in the screen, but over there. And we bought this little camera here. It's called a Breno. Breno? I don't know how to pronounce it, but here it is. And this thing is pretty cool. Eli, stay here, buddy because it's a time-lapse camera, so you can set it to take pictures at different intervals, and we're gonna leave it up for the entire time we build the house. So the whole time that we're building our house, it's gonna be taking pictures, so we'll get progress pictures. And we've got it set to take a picture, oh, and a there. picture is actually come, like come five seconds there. worth of video. Now, now. I'll go down there with you. It might even be 10 seconds worth of video, I can't remember, but it does that every 30 come minutes. Can we go down there? Okay. Yeah. Does it every 30 minutes from 6 a.m. until 9 p.m. So it'll get the progress of the complete build of the house, which I'm really excited about. So we're going to put that up tonight and start filming. They're going to pour the floors of our basement and our garage tomorrow. So we're going to be able to start framing this week, which is really exciting. I'm just going to show you a quick video of the progress of the house. Mommy, so I will, buddy. Here, you're on video. Say hi. Hi. So you can see our garage here. They put some dirt up to where we're actually gonna be driving and you're okay, Levi. And then over here, they knocked in some of the dirt to start filling in next to the walls. So you see that dirt here. And then down here, if I ever make it down here, I'm coming, Eli. Is where James did his plumbing. So you can see here, Let 
This is gonna be a sink that drains out. I have no idea what those two wooden stakes are, so we'll have to ask James. But back here is where our bathroom is gonna be. So that big black thing you see in the right-hand corner is the sub pump. That's what pulls the poop and pee out and launches us up the wall, out that hole, right there. And then everything else you see, all that plumbing, that is a bathtub, a toilet, a sink, a drain in case our basement floods, and I think that's it, yeah. So anyway, it's looking really, really, really good. I'm excited about it. Well, I made a big mistake. I decided not to change him out of his nice pair of white and blue checkered shorts that he had on, and now he's playing in the mud with them, and he's covered, so. I see that. I want any day I can go here. Ah! The water! The water! Ah! Ah! It's living in a pool. Good morning. So the concrete workers are over there pouring the pouring the floor of the basement, so we're gonna go check it out. Got the boys with me, of course. So we're gonna go see what they're doing. After today, we're done with concrete, and we can start framing, so it's very exciting. Daddy is very muddy, so is mommy. We're gonna have to take baths tonight. Oh, I I have to take a bath too. Yeah, you have to take a bath too. You're very muddy also. But it's been pretty good. Actually, I, I love living here. So even though we're living in a camper, I really don't mind it. It's not bad. The only thing that's 
Yeah. The only thing that's hard about it is when it rains because I can't take the kids outside. Well, I can, but it doesn't go well. Or number two, just trying to get the kids in bed just because at nighttime we're all in one tiny space. There's not like separate rooms. So, ouch, goodness gracious, your teeth are sharp. You left a mark. So it's just hard to get them in bed because I try to get them in bed early, but then I'm not ready for bed yet. You want to sit with me? Right up here, right here. Marshmallow. You got a marshmallow? But today, believe it or not, is actually our first night having a fire because we have been so busy on the farm that every night we literally work until dark and then we just quickly shower and get in bed and get ready for work the next day. So we haven't really had a fire. So tonight's our first night and we're enjoying it. Levi, say hi. And this one is getting through lots of marshmallows before bed. So I'm sure bedtime tonight will be rough, but we'll get through it right. Right. Eli, do you like living in the camper? Yeah. Do you like living on the farm? Now we're going to build a house. That's right, we are going to build a house with a wraparound porch. Uh -huh. James, do you like living in the camper so far? Yeah, I like living in the camper because I get to stay down here at my farm all the time. <laughs> that sounded very scripted. It sounded like you were saying that. All right, Eli, can you say night-night? Night-night. Say, I'm going to go take a bath. I'm going to take a bath. Oh, careful. This is for taking my ears. This is for taking my ears. Daddy, you fix this? It is fixed.